with this one. What's after object detection? After object detection, we need object tracking. There is a crucial difference between detection and tracking. When we work with videos for our computer, it's just a video, it's just image after image, frame after frame. We need object tracking to associate a univocal ID to the object so that we can keep track of the objects when they're moving. There are many algorithms for that. Let me implement this. So from engine.object tracking, we're going to import multi object tracking, MOT equals multi object tracking. We select a simple algorithm OC sort tracker dot equals MOT dot OC sort. Also, this one that I'm showing you is an implementation that I made of this to make this very simple and straightforward. Now, from object detection, we take all the objects that are passing here and we apply the object tracking algorithm. Update tracker, here we pass everything. Our copilot should just already know everything. So tracker.update, we give the bounding boxes, score, class this and EMG. And now we loop through this, through each track object and we will have our object track. Now, you see almost everything as before, but there is a crucial difference that we have an ID above each bottle. This means that we have the object tracking implemented. You see now this one is 21. If I let it go, it's still 21. We put a line. So when the product crosses that line, we say, okay, now we identify the product, we extract everything. Let's do that. Uh, let me first tell you why do we need to put a line? Let's say that the products are crossing. Now we have two products here. We have two bottles. One is ID 10. You see their ID 10 and one ID 5. There is five and zero, the one on the left. We want to identify the bottle when it's well visible, like the bottle 10, it's well visible. It's almost at the center of the screen. And that's the moment where we want to do the inspection. The one that's five there now, it's only half of the bottle visible. And if we don't say where to do the inspection, then we have the problem that's visible everywhere and we have their half bottle and that's a problem. We draw now a line. Uh, we can, you can choose based on the product and what visual you have. We draw a yellow line in the middle of the screen and that's we say, okay, when the product reaches this line, let's do the inspection. Uh, let's get center of the image. Here we have a uh, height and width of the image. We extract image. Uh, which is called ROI, we have a region of interest. Uh, that's what's happening now when it's crossing the line and you see we have the image extracted, now we have the bottle and we have the image of each part.